We're gonna do some things. Happy Friday, high day. That's a song uh, we put out a couple years ago called Answers. It's funny, the, the cover to that song is actually a picture of us in a sweet tub somewhere in the Blackthorn. I don't know which room we were in, but it's us in a sweet little tub. A red tub. Were you naked? No, no, full, like layers and layers. It was a surprising tub. We're going to do a couple of new ones today. This one's a new one. As a songwriter, you don't like to be too much on the nose. So I'll preface by saying, I swear to God, this isn't about those masks. It's about a different kind of mask. Couldn't wear a mask like that if it didn't have holes in the eyes And that's where I'll get you by and by Maybe, maybe you were born this way, but we both know nothing ever stays the same Only crows are slowly dying And it's a long drive to hell And the sun Couldn't wear a mask like that if it didn't have holes in the eyes so you can make sure they buy your lies Good for nothing is a fine excuse to get good at nothing but it falls on you This isn't shade, it's dead of night Here's another new one. This is a, a rough one to write. It took, it took uh, longer than most of them do. It was tough. Uh, sometimes you want songs to have some type of cool message or, or moral of the story or whatever it is. And this one didn't really have one. It just kind of started building rooms and walls and furniture and characters and nonsense and never really came to a, a clear conclusion, but some songs just go like that. It's about a mother and her son, and it's called Basement Checks. I can see your bouncing heel in the reflection, trying to fill all the gaps. 
gaps in the door Not quite winter, but close enough to worry Close enough to numb your fingers and threatening even more And you wonder whatever for Play some salt, ask which basement's next Steal a bike, steal a book, write some checks The need goes on and shall go on, that's what a need is for Pestilent nails, greasy fingers, always wanting more You wonder whatever for Yeah, you seem to be working hard, stretch a dollar pretty far And never gripe about some life that never was To holler if they need you Mr. Wright says his wife's on the man Scared what you're scared of has already happened A cartoon cliff jump, a headless feathered friend And you wonder what end Keep the trash out and hum an old reflection Head back home in the dying of the day your fingers and let your ring dig at you. It could be worse, maybe better. It's not better anyway. Maybe it's okay. Yeah, you seem to be working hard, stretch a dollar pretty far. You never gripe about some life that never was. Thought you were better than that, but I guess the sun always does. the sun Cats. Speaking of thanks, cats. Um, if you like what you hear, we do have a new record just came out called Thanks, Cats. It's on the Bandcamp and the Spotify and the places. Y'all know the places where you do the band thing. We've been playing a bunch of bluegrass festivals this summer. It's been good to be back out and doing the thing. Thanks everybody for coming out and enjoying live music in spite of a very strange time to be alive. But yeah, we've been doing a bunch of grass festivals, so we figured we might as well do a couple grass tunes. Here's an old fiddle tune and an old Stanley Brothers tune. There's a bee in my beer, should I drink it? Does the stinger fall off? I don't know.
First song in a long time that I was actually happy about when it was over. A lot of songs you write and you're kind of like, mm, that was rough. That was a tough time. Got through it though. This song should be okay. This one I was actually stoked to play afterwards, which is a rare thing. While we're changing it up here, shout out Drew, Rich, everybody who's making this sweet, awesome thing happen. It really is, uh, it is exceptionally good to be back out playing music after a long, strange, 18-month winter. <laughs> Friday, high day. This one goes out to my grandfather. It turned 91 last month. Nice. And uh, he used to drive around in this Oldsmobile when I was a kid, and it was a piece of shit, and he drove it for decades. And then uh, he retired, and uh, he ended up with this old Mercedes. And I thought that was the coolest thing in the whole world when I was a kid. And I always wanted to stick that Mercedes in a song, and I finally did. It's a song about getting old. It's called Golden Years. got this board I thought about getting old I'd drive around in a smoked out Mercedes Benz and wave to all of my friends I'd sell herbs and spices twice a week at the market down the street And I pour my wife a nightly glass of whiskey.
got this board Thought about getting old We'd revel in a cool breeze And hot late summer days Mapping out our next getaway We wouldn't have a boat But we'll have a friend who does And a festival season bus Just because As far as what comes next I know That's much as birds crashing into the window Bigger seeds and pictures Far from clear I might as well make these my golden years this board I thought about getting old Oh Thanks cats Oh this is very fun Funny story about that banjo set That banjo uh me and Danny have been playing guitar together for a very long time a very long time in fact, this, this dude was, uh, was recording us and telling us how to be not quite uh, such insolent children uh, long before we ever picked up a mandolin and a banjo. And uh, when we were playing guitar together, I picked a mandolin, he picked up a banjo, and he was playing one for a little while. And uh, we came up here a couple years ago, and uh, someone was selling a, a Vega banjo over there. And uh, Danny picked it up, and he has been playing it ever since. So uh, it's almost like this whole set wouldn't really be happening if not for Fly Day. So thanks to Fly Day and all the folks for making it such a cool place to be. So there really wasn't anything to write about the last year and a half as far as people goes. So I had to get a little weird with it. There was a bear in the driveway last summer. And he didn't really do much of anything besides bear things. Trash, getting chased off of the 22 by a strange neighbor. But I figured, what if he was a spooky bear? And what if he liked to wear face paint? And what if he liked to take people away and ask them strange questions? Wouldn't that be fun? Anyway, it came out like this called Bear Tune. Stepped out to check on the flowers, they're lovely. And I stare for a minute or twelve. The red wings calling while I'm out here yawning. A squirrel's been gutted, a hawk's been long here, a breeze blows. And I'm whirling three feet off the ground. back so is mine and the needles 
are browning and fading to dust. What a strange morning when a woodchuck gives warning, crawls out from the shed, tells me I'm not alone in voice. And I'm back on the ground when I see there's a bear in the driveway. change it up again a little bit. Again, if you like what you hear, we're Eugene Tyler Band. We're on the Spotify, the Bandcamp, the Instagram, the Apple Music, the Napster, Waze, Google Maps. It's all over the place. We also got uh, some vinyl and some CDs that just came out and uh, some new t-shirts and stuff, so if you want to check it out back there, we got a whole lineup of stuff. Oh, we got lighters too, smoke o'clock. Lighters by our dear friend Kit Clark. He's relatively local. This one goes out to the dying hornet, wasp, whatever it is. It's a Tom Petty song. It's called Apartment. I used to live in a tearing apartment, neighbors knocking on my wall. Times are hard. It much at all. Oh yeah, I'm alright. Just feeling lonely tonight. I'm okay most of the time. Just feeling lonely tonight. I used to need your love so badly, then I came to live with it. Lately I get a far away feeling, and the whole thing starts again. Oh yeah. 
Oh, man. Here's another one off that Thanks Cats record. It's, uh, it's the first record we made exclusively as a trio. We've bounced around with a lot of weird stuff in the studio before, so... Again, if you like what you hear, Thanks Cats is the record. Here's a song about long, hot summer days and all the sweet plans you make for the fall that end up turning into New Year's resolutions that turn into more stuff to do next fall. It's called Longest Day. neighbors, fly day high dayers. We're going to do a little more grass for you. Oh, also, uh, if you like what you hear and you feel like maybe catching another ETB set, we're, uh, we're doing a short run uh, in the area in a couple of weeks. Next weekend. next weekend. Oh my God, next week. Next weekend, yeah. If you, uh, 
If you're around and you want to catch us in Hunter or West Kill or Wyndham or Mountaindale, we're going to be around. So come say hey, see what's up. Here's a song about racing or something. Yeah, special shout out to Klaus for keeping me hydrated and lovely today.
Mark Jaffe on bass and vocals over there. To my right is Danny Tyler on guitar and banjo. My name's Eugene, I do some stuff. One more thanks cats for getting down and listening to some live music it's been a very long strange time without it so it really uh really means a lot to see some some old faces some new faces some pretty faces oh it finally died it took a while to drown i feel really bad now go be free this is a tune about me and d getting lost in the woods and deciding to climb a mountain on the day of a show and it was a mountain that we had never been on before and it was a little bit of a silly endeavor and we ended up basically running down a, uh, a 14,000 foot mountain and uh, had a hell of a gig the, the, that afternoon. It was a strange one. It's called Rocky. It goes like this. Thank you. 
Thanks, Catherine, Eugene, Tyler, man. Have yourselves a day, huh?